Hello, my name is Stephen Daniel with the Avaya Serviceability Engineering team. This video is about the Avaya Secure Access Link Policy Server and Device Access Control. The Avaya Secure Access Link Gateway already provides a secure method of remote access for your Avaya solutions. However, there may be times when a greater level of security is required by your enterprise. With a cell policy server deployed in your environment and integrated with your cell gateway, you can do just that. The policy server lets you decide and puts you in complete control of who, what, and when your Avaya devices are accessed. The cell policy server can be configured to define a specific level of access to one or all of your Avaya devices with rules such as always allow, never allow, or ask for approval. You can integrate your policy server with your enterprise LDAP and restrict access based on who is requesting access to your devices. You are able to restrict access based on time of day rules. You can create a blacklist, a whitelist, or both to determine who is able to access your equipment. And most importantly, you can combine various types of restrictions to create very specific policy for your devices. For example, you could restrict anyone from a blacklist for a given time of day to only a subset of your devices. So how does all this work? Well, it's quite simple. The job of the policy server is to define policy, while the job of the gateway is to enforce it. Any policy that we define in our policy server is consumed by one or more of our integrated gateways and enforced against all of its managed devices. Let's take a look at this following diagram to illustrate a few examples of what policy we can define to restrict access to a given device. In this deployment, we have a cell policy server integrated with our cell gateway and enterprise LDAP server. Integration with the cell gateway is required However, integration with an LDAP server is optional, though highly recommended as it will allow you more latitude and flexibility when defining policy. Suppose we have defined the following two policies. Policy 1 states to never allow access to our session manager server, denoted here by the SM, say for instance because it's a lab system. Now, when a connection attempt comes across from a user at Avaya, the first thing the gateway does is consult a copy of the policy it has obtained from the policy server and do a comparison to the device the user is requesting access to. Recognizing that the access attempt is destined for a device that is set to never allow, the gateway halts any attempt to make a connection to the session manager server and sends a message back to the cell concentrator remote server advising the user that a defined policy has restricted access to this device and that it cannot set up the connection. Moving on to our second scenario, policy 2 states that we are to restrict access from anyone during the hours of 6 p.m. to 11.59 p.m from connecting to any of our systems due to a scheduled testing period. Let's assume again that the connection request is coming from someone out of Aya and they are attempting to connect to our CM server at 8 p.m. in the evening. When the connection attempt comes across, the cell gateway will again check its policy and see that there is a policy in place restricting access to all devices during this time period. So just like our earlier scenario, our cell gateway sends a message back to the cell concentrator remote server advising the user that a defined policy has restricted access and cannot set up the connection. Obviously, there are many more types of policy and policy combinations you could define to control and restrict access to your VICE solutions. What we have demonstrated here only begins to scratch the surface of what the SAP policy server can do for your enterprise. Thank you for your time today. We welcome comments, questions, and feedback at mentor at avaya.com or on Twitter at avaya mentor. For more details or related information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you for choosing Avaya.